urban farm in the Elyria Swansea neighborhood. It's being recognized for coming together for Colorado. Today, Colorado's first gentleman stopped by Grow House to celebrate what it's doing for its community. Tori Mason joins us from there tonight. And Tori, this farm certainly means a lot to that neighborhood. Absolutely, Karen. The Grow House gives people in Elyria Swansea access to healthy, affordable food. Today, they're celebrating the area's youngest eco-friendly neighbors. Eco Ninos is a, cel a collaboration between Mr. G, Moms Clean Air Force, and Green Latinos. It celebrates young people finding solutions for eco challenges in their communities. Our kids have to live in whatever kind of world we leave them. Eco Ninos aims to make it a sustainable one. Colorado's first gentleman, Marlon Reese, also came along for a tour of the Green the Grow House. He and Governor Polis have two young children together. The vegan and animal activist says it's important we put kids in touch with the food they eat. Walking down grocery aisles and not necessarily even recognizing where the food comes from or not asking the questions. So uh, to me, this is very inspiring. But the idea is to really bring people together so that children can help work together to find solutions in the challenges we face around climate change. Now to learn more about Eco Ninos and the work being done here at the Grow House, you can head on over to cbsdenver.com. We're live in Denver, Tori Mason, covering Colorado First. All right, Tori, thank you. For more Together for Colorado Stories, please join me for Together with Karen Lee, show dedicated to the good news going on in our communities.